This project is sponsored by Altium 365. Altium 365 is a cloud-based platform designed for electronics design and engineering. It provides a suite of tools for PCB design, including equipment management, supply chain, library management, ECAD connectivity, co-design and integrations, and manufacturing portal. Accelerate your time to market with Altium 365 streamlined workflows, real-time collaboration tools, and automated process that reduce design iterations and rework. Explore Altium 365 and step into the future of electronic development. Hello, an hourglass is a device used to measure the passage of time. It consists of two glass bulbs connected by a narrow passage, allowing the substance typically fine sand to flow from the upper bulb to the lower uh, at, at a constant, consistent rate. Once all the sands has followed through the, to the lower bulb, the hourglass is flipped to measure time again. The time takes for the sand to flow completely from one bulb to the other depends on size of the hourglass and the amount of sand. Recently, in one of my previous projects, I presented you uh, with, uh, with a way to create a virtual hourglass on a small OLED display. In this project, quite the opposite, I will present you with another simple way to make such a device, uh, but now on a huge color display, which actually represents a 16 on 16 LED matrix with LEDs, each of which contains a WS2812B LED chip, so that each LED can be controlled individually. The device is very simple to make and consists of a few components. ESP32 development board, 16 on 16 LED matrix with WS2812B LEDs, next tilt switch and small speaker. The components are built into a suitable box made of PVC material that I made for a previous project of mine and on the front of the matrix there is, an, there is a 3D printed grid for which you can find the STL file at the end of the text. To achieve a more realistic simulation, I use this small tilt switch, so by rotating the clock by 180 degrees, the countdown starts over. If we look at the code, we will see that it is designed in a way that allows us to easily change almost all parameters, starting from the number of particles through the flow rate, the brightness of the LEDs, and even defining the colors. In particular, we can change the color of the hourglass, hourglass wall, the sand, the environment around it, the internal empty space, as well as the color of the numbers. The numbers on both sides of the hourglass shows the remaining time in seconds. I also added simply so simple sound effect to start and end the countdown, as well as a short sound to indicate each second that passes. And now let's see from the beginning how this look in reality. Immediately after switching on, a sound effect is emitted that indicates uh, the start of the countdown and with each passing second a short beep. In the upper bowl, there are 30 grains of sand that should run out in one minute, so each grain runs out to the lower bowl in two seconds. The grains in the lower bowl are arranged randomly, uh, which is another approximation to a real simulation.
after one minute paste past uh, a sound effect is emitted that indicates the end of the countdown and now all the sand particles are in the lower bowl. If I now rotate the hourglass 180 degrees, the countdown starts from the, from the beginning. And finally a short conclusion, this is a visually impressive hourglass simulation project and despite, despite its simplicity there are many possibilities for modifying most parameters.